Hello, this is feeding time, and uh, my two turtles, my Razorback Musk Turtle and Three Stripe Mud Turtle, Oswald and Alfred, are foraging for cichlid pellets. That's who it is for, but that's who is eating it. cichlid pellets sink so they don't have to go anywhere they don't have to go to the surface they don't have to try for their food it just comes to them Oswald you're being lazy your reptamen is at the surface it's up there go get it there is the reptamen And this guy likes the reptamen. That is a chocolate cichlid. His name is Clarence. Dun, 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 dun. Spends a lot of his time looking at the surface, wanting to eat, looking to eat. Oh, there's Oswald going up for the surface. This is our third turtle, Leopold. He's a Mississippi map. Haven't had any problems with turtles bothering fish. These guys were all started um, with fish when they were hatchlings. And um, they, uh, they don't bother them at all. This is a 135 gallon. some sand and rocks on the bottom. Back we have three filters for all these fish, a Fluval FX5, an Eheim 2217, and a Cascade 1000. So, tons of filtration. There's a gold gourami. Some rainbow fish. This is a massive pleco. We've had him a while. And there's his buddy. These things just keep growing. Blue Akara down there. Always hanging out at the bottom. Got lots of hiding areas. for everybody for those who like to hide experimented with plants earlier um, you can see in the back those are uh, two different types of swords and they're not doing so well um, the plants that do well in this tank are my Anubius and Java Fern. I have them tied to the driftwood over here. And also over here, they are tied to the driftwood as well. Tank is six feet long, and it's a uh, it's a lot of fun just to look at. These guys are the most fun, though. The tent uh, is a little greenish. Um, don't really have a big algae problem. The, the UVA UVB light for the turtles 
has um, it casts a greenish tint on the water. And I have uh, I have two UVA UVB lights. I have one uh, right here. This is a plant growth light. Obviously, it doesn't work. This is UVA UVB, and this is just a regular light over here. There's my heat lamp for the turtles and a basking dock. But the Razorback Musk Turtle, Oswald as I call him, never uses it. There he is down there. He's entirely aquatic. Alfred, my three striped mud turtle, rarely uses it. Where is he? There he is. He's up by the heat stick. And Leopold, my Mississippi map turtle, he likes to use it, but only when you're not around. These are my two favorite fish. That's a green severum and a chocolate cichlid. My chocolate cichlid, I thought he had a hole in the head disease, but he got bit in the head actually by um, one of my uh, blue acaras. My blue acaras are pretty mean. I read that they were nice, but they're not. That's the guy back there. Um, he, he's always striped and he's always upset about something. So he got in an altercation with my chocolate cichlid and, and uh, that was yesterday. But anyway, I think he'll recover. Just fed him, so we got lots of food on the ground. What are you doing there, Alfred? This is rare because this turtle never goes over to the left side of the tank. He's always over here. But let's see where he's headed. There's a little rainbow shark there. Had him a long time. That's my other blue car. He's pretty nice. So, um, yeah, I don't understand why some of them are mean, some of them are nice. But um, I guess they're like people. Some of them are just jerks. I feed the turtles snails. I have a snail tank in the back. I breed them and I put snails in for them. But sometimes they eat other things like. Uh, looks like this guy is eating a pleco chip that fell in there for the plecos. But you can't really control. They have a mind of their own. I ordered a large piece of driftwood. So these plants are going to be coming out of there within the next couple weeks and replaced by a large piece of driftwood. I'll post another video when that happens. I'm going to tie some Anubias and Java fern to it. Uh, just like, uh, like this driftwood. And I think it'll look really nice. That's all for now.